Hello my loves and welcome back to another video. Hello, if you're new here, I'm Chrissy, I'm a mum of two. I like to post all things motherhood, lifestyle and haul related content on this channel. If you're existed, welcome back as always. Hope you're all having a lovely day. The weather here is just... <laughs> so I thought I'd better get this video out because the weather's hot again today, believe it or not. This is a huge spring, summer, holiday shop clothing for my two girls Lola and Lily. If you're new here Lola is seven and Lily is four and we're going on holiday soon so I bought them quite a bit more than I usually would because you know what it's like in the UK it's a little bit but yeah I've got all sorts of items here from places such as Next, F&F um, &F, which is Tesco's, I've also got Primark because Primark has all the essentials and there are a few bits that they've already got that obviously I'm not going to include in this haul because this is all their new bits. So yeah, if you've got two girls, similar ages or even if they're not and you just want to see what I'm getting them to wear for the spring, summer, all pretty affordable, a few nice bits and yeah, stick around and I'll show you what I got. And as always, if you like this video, it's a really easy and simple way that you can support my channel and it doesn't cost you a penny, is give this video a big thumbs up. It means more than you know. Stick around, check out my other videos, let me know what you think in the comments below. And as always, I'll be there to chat with you down below as well. So yeah, not going to waffle, let's just get into it. So I'm going to start with Primark because I absolutely love Primark. Haven't gone too mad in Primark because I did a Primark haul for them not long ago before we moved house. So they didn't need too much because I'd already like stocked up on, you know, the £3.50 dresses. If you don't know, get to know. Really good. But yeah, as we're going away, got them both some knickers each. These were £5 pack. Can't go wrong, can you? 10 pairs. Pop them straight in the suitcase as they are ready to go. And always what I do is a little hack if your children are similar size in knickers and you're forever like wondering whose is whose. I always get Lily dogs and load of cats, that way I know. Or you can stamp them with their name if you have not got time for that. This is another little tip. So yeah, pick those up. Sunglasses, literally a pound, can't go wrong, Primark. Probably get broken, probably get lost, but I don't know any little girl who doesn't love wearing sunglasses, especially when on holiday. And then another boring purchase, but I just picked them but I just picked them up, these three pack of vests. Lily's already wore one. Um, and these were really, really reasonable. £3.80 for three vests. And I thought these would really be good to wear to bed. Because my children don't like wearing pyjamas, if I'm being honest. They like to sleep in the nude. So I thought they could wear them with their knickers. Or they're just really good to put with a pair of shorts, aren't they? They're just staples, aren't they, little vests? And then they'll wear them in the winter as well when they want to wear them under their clothes. So yeah, pick them up both of those. Not everything is matching in this haul. It's just things like that. I just tend to get them the same. And then last but not least with the matchy matchy. This is lovely. Absolutely obsessed with this. Primark again. How much are the shorts? The shorts are £3 and the top £2.50. And they do them in all different colours. And this is the second set that I've bought Lily. Because she wears these to preschool. They're really fab and they wash really well as well. So I picked them both up. What I call a co-ord set. This is brilliant just to chill at home, round the pool on holiday. And you don't really care too much if they get stains and ice cream and jelly and God knows what down there. Because really, really cheap and affordable. I went into Primark and I was like, they don't need anything. They don't need anything. But I couldn't help but pick this up for Lola. So Lola's my seven-year-old. This was £6.50. A little bit more pricey. But it's tie-dye and it's beautiful. Really, really like this top. And then it also comes with the cycling shorts. But they're like baggy cycling shorts. So yeah, she might even travel to the airport in that because it's just something really soft and the material's really soft. And on the front, it just says, to, it's cool to be kind. This is genius. So when my children were really little, story time here, I used to always put them in the hooded towels that kind of lift over their head and they're just brilliant, aren't they? But I found as they get older, they don't do bigger versions. Like I wish they had an adult version. I would totally rock that. Well, in Primark, they had the bigger hooded towels and they had this. So, don't get me wrong, these, I think they were in the adult section. So, they're really big for the kids, but I don't even care. It's a hooded towel material. Right, stay with me. And it has a zip. How amazing is that? If your children do swimming lessons or anything like that in the summer, this is fab. Or even for getting out of the bath, you know, in the winter and they're really, really cold. Pop this on, it's like a full-blown hoodie. So I got them both one. I got Lola a medium 
because I just wanted it to be really, really oversized. You know, especially if you're on holiday and you're a little bit sunburned or they caught the sun and they just want to sit in their hooded towel in the shade. Fab. And I've got Lily, who's four. I've got the small. Um, it is miles too big. I'm not going to lie. I do need to roll up the sleeves, etc., etc. But what a fab little buy. And how much were you? So they were £10, but they were scanning it till at £8, I remember, because my friend got them for her little girl as well. So yeah, this is probably like my favourite purchase of this whole haul, just because it's really nifty, isn't it? Nifty. Like, who am I? Who even says the word nifty anymore? Um, soz if you do, but I don't, but I do now. And then I just picked them up a baseball bat. Bat? A baseball cap. These were literally £1.50. They're just ideal, aren't they? And then obviously I got them a cute hat. The reason why I buy two hats is because you lose one on holiday, don't you? When you lose one, even at home, nursery, school, holiday, I like to have a spare. And this one was really cute. These were £3. Pom-pom design. And then last few bits from Primark. I got them both a pair of these pumps. These were £8 and they're lovely. Don't get me wrong, they're probably not going to stay white for long. But they're brilliant for the spring, summer month. I just thought they were really cute. They've got a pastel purple on the back and I both got them both a matching pair but Lily's managed to already wear hers and they're like beige now but yeah and then obviously because the bikinis are so blimmin cute in um Primark I got them both a little strawberry and pink bikini each because they're so sweet and we do go swimming a lot at home they do swimming lessons and we're going on holiday like I said so three pounds a set you just can't really go wrong so I picked them both up I probably would say though size up I've not done on Lola, but I definitely have for Lily. And then on to the F and F bits. My mum picked these up for the girls actually. I didn't pay for these, so thanks, mum. They're a really, really cute swimming costume again, pastel blue. I love the ruffle detail at the front. And then you've got the frill on the bottom as well on the pants. So they've both got matching set here. My mum used to always dress me and my sister in matching clothes when we were kids. Like, did your mum do that for you? Comment down below. Last Primark thing. I was with the kids in Primark and Lola wanted this for the plane. It's not really fitting, is it, for a clothing haul, but I just thought I'd show you it anyway. Um, ideal, worth every penny, especially if you're on a longer haul flight. We were only going for four hours, but it was still coming really, 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 really helpful. And then on to the next clothing haul absolutely huge but i'll try and section it into the girls bits so pick this beautiful dress up really really love the color of this lily's actually already tried this on and ripped the tag off of it but i believe this was 11 pounds which i didn't think was too bad for next really cute love the stripy pattern and love the pastel-y but also bright colors oh how much better is that my back's aching, showing you everything. And then I picked this up for Lily. I absolutely love this. This was £20, but I just love all the different patterns on the dress. I got this in age four to five. I normally do size up with her as she's four. I normally get a five to six, but four to five fits her perfectly in this dress. And it's so sweet. It comes with a little t-shirt, which will come in handy as well, because I can pop this with other items. Yeah, really like it. And this one, oh my god, this literally has my heart. It's so sweet. Got this in five to six. It's a little top and skirt combo. So sweet. Absolutely love it. And you get a little matching headband as well. So I thought when she goes to the disco at night one day, she might like to wear this. Or if she wants it more casual in the day, she can have it with the top or can put it with a cute little strappy vest top to dress it up a little bit. But no, it's really, really sweet. And I love these kind of sets because you can mix and match them. So yeah, how much was that? That was £19, which I don't think is bad at all. Got a cute little denim skirt. Like I said, I could pop this with one of the vests that I bought her or a t-shirt. Really sweet. And this was £9.50. That's what I mean. Like you think next is a lot more expensive. It's not as massively as expensive as you think. For example, this top, £4.50. That pound more than it'd be in Primark. And the quality is a little bit better. Um, so yeah, got her that. That will go really cute with this as well. £10 this was. Again, all the different prints because this is just a Lily dress. If you know Lily personally, you'll know what I mean. She'll absolutely love this. Really sweet. Last but not least, for Lily, this was £13. So cute. I've got this matching as well. So Lola's got a dress like this as well. It's just a cute little holiday dress, isn't it? That she's going to live and die in. She's been dying to wear this to nursery for 
weeks and weeks but i wanted to keep it new for a holiday right now on to lola i've got her a cute pair of just basic shorts from next really sweet really comfy she likes to be cozy as your children get older i don't know about you they're more obligated on what they want to wear so she's all about the cozy life so yeah i've got some staple shorts and then this oh this is really sweet i've got her this little top it looks tiny but it is her age and this was 14 pounds that would go really cute and i wanted to pair that with these shorts these aren't from next these are from asda believe it or not but the high waist high waisted denim shorts but they're a soft denim and they were nine pounds and she also got them in pink i got them ages ago and then another cute little t-shirt just basics especially if she's just chilling by the pool or just wants to be comfy cozy and yeah we all love to be cozy in this house and then this is one of my favorites again she could wear this on the oh i'm getting pins and needles oh <laughs> oh i've got pins and needles it really hurts and then i've got her this one really really cute love this little co-ord set again this was 18 pounds but it's just beautiful and um, we've got her an age eight in that one because i find their age stuff i size up to the next age because seven is almost like six to seven and then so eight would be like seven to eight which she is another basic little vest top four pound fifty just a pretty staple isn't it for the summer season and then this where is it this i'm obsessed with like if they had this in my size i would 100 buy it for myself it's a really beautiful play suit beautiful material as well it's like a chiffony material really lightweight and it's got a cut out bit at the back oh just love it so much um i'll give you a close-up of the design so you can see so sweet and this i believe was 13 pounds really nice this is probably one of my favorites i got this dress which is 13 pounds the same as lily so she can match and then this is just a really cute t-shirt dress 10 pounds this was from m&s really really like this really cool isn't it this would look amazing with a pair of sliders and then last but not least they've both got this cardigan but lily's is in the wash because i let her wear it this was 11 pounds and it's just a staple isn't it? it literally goes with most of their clothes so yeah that was everything i haven't included shoes and things like that because um i didn't want this haul to be so big but i will be packing for you guys and filming it and vlogging it but I will be filming a pack with me for my children on holiday. So if you want to see more of what I'm taking on holiday, then stay tuned for that. Hit the notification bell and you'll be notified every time I upload. But yeah, I hope you like this haul. It's a bit random. I don't think I've done a kids haul on my channel before. But I just thought, as a mum myself, sometimes it's nice just to see what other mums have bought. Um, and get a little bit of inspiration. And all of it's colourful. Because, I don't know about you, not like pointing not pointing the finger or anything but i don't know about you i do find quite a lot of mums are putting all their kids in beige clothes like i don't understand like why they're little i just want them to be in colorful beautiful patterned clothes not to suit my lounge decor does that make sense so yeah so it's not sars but yeah if you do like this video like i said please give it a big thumbs up and if you're new and you haven't subscribed i'd absolutely love to have you as part of this youtube family and if you are a subscriber coming back thank you so much and i hope you're all having a lovely day i seem a bit high today i'm definitely not i've been working all day in the office that's why i thought i'd switch it up and film this in the living room and i'm just tired and this is how i go sometimes when i'm tired i ever go or we'll go woo and then i've got to go pick the kids up and we're going to soft play because it's friday and we always go soft play on a friday and now i'm like Meh. but <laughs> i'm not sure when this video will be up but i'm trying to get loads of content filmed and uploaded for you so when i go on holiday there'll still be uploads going live because i like to stick to my schedule which is currently two times a week so yeah i hope you're all having a lovely day and i'll check in with you guys soon and yeah much love